Hitting the right people at the right time with the right message is crucial for your advertising success. Hi, you guys. I'm Caitlin Strempel, CEO of Rising Ranks, and today we're going to talk about the four different types of content that you should be writing. So if you've been following me, you know that I follow the four C's of marketing strategy. Many people don't follow this, so I can give you the breakdown, but we follow the catch, connect, close, and continue. So it's essentially taking your consumer or you know potential consumer through this journey to actually get them to buy from you and to continue to buy from you. So the four C's, catch. This is where you're going to be really driving awareness for your brand, what you do. And this is the first step. And this is where most people are gonna find you first. After that, what are you gonna do to connect with them? So connecting is all about building a relationship, getting them to like, know, and trust you. And then once you have that down, you can move into the close, which is essentially asking for the sale and asking for them to allow you to serve them. And that is the third part. So you really have to get them, they have to know about you, then they have to like you. And of course, then, you know, once they trust you and all that good stuff, you can actually close the deal if it's something that they are interested in and if it's you know really for them. And after that is continue. So how are you gonna you know get these repeat customers? How are you gonna get them to come back and to truly become a brand advocate of yours? So they're telling other people and they're buying from you again. So this is essential and every single marketing strategy that you put in place should have all of these four C's. The thing is though, is that you can't have the same message for every single step of the way. It has to change along the way or else you're just gonna lose people. So let's get into the catch. So when you're driving awareness, this is to a cold audience. So you really want to lead with their pain points. That's what's gonna get people to be like, oh yeah, you know, I do have that pain point. That's right, let me pay attention. So once you get that down and you know your messaging is all about you know the problem that you fix, you need to connect with them. So right now these people are aware of you. They may have clicked through to your website. So they're becoming a warmer audience, but they really do need to like, know, and trust you a little bit more. So this in your advertising, this is where you lead with, you know, what is special about you that's actually gonna get them from their pain point to where they actually wanna be from point A to point B. And on top of that, you want to show them how you are an authority in the space. All right, so you, what's what makes you special? And then you also wanna show them like, yeah, I also drive results. I'm special and I drive results. And here's the proof. So this could look like anything from accolades that you have, from case studies to even just testimonials. So once you get there and once you connect with them, it's time for the close. So these leads are now hot leads because you've taken them through and they now are so invested in you and they love you, they love your method, and they are ready to work with you. So right now, this is where you actually are going to lead with your solution. Yes, you have this pain point and here's my method. Now it's time to be like, all right, you guys, this is what you need. This is what I have for you that's actually going to make your life so much better. So what you do here is when you're talking to these hot leads is you are leading with the solution, like I said, and you are truly... So here when they come in there, yes, they have the solution. Some people might not be ready. So they might have objections. Maybe it's too much money or maybe they're not ready. And you really have to lead with those most common objections. The more you advertise, the more you talk to people, the more you're going to know what these objections are to you. So you really have to get in there and right away abolish anything that would you know make them say no. And also lead with a vision. So you are really tapping into that bigger vision that you are trying to lead them to and really get them excited. Let them, you know, feel and touch and taste exactly what it's going to look like and feel like when they get to, you know, this grand place that you're going to take them to. And then of course, continue. So these are your red hot leads. They've already purchased from you 
and you know it's time to turn them into brand advocates and really it's by surprising and delighting them and delivering the results that you promise you have to do that once you do that once you're giving them a great experience and results you can honestly just tell them that you have a product all you have to do is give them the information and they are going to want to scoop that up right away and tell all of their friends all right you guys so make sure that you are really staying true and really understanding what audience you're talking to so you know if it's facebook ads to a cold audience it's going to be your cold audience if it's a retargeting it's going to be more of your warm audience and you know your hot audience if these people are on your email list they are definitely a warm and hot audience if they already are a part of your tribe if they purchased before from you and they are telling other people they are red hot and you should really align your advertising appropriately. And that's what's truly going to make you find the best success with your advertising. All right, you guys, if you found this helpful, if you liked it, please comment below, please share, please follow along and come and find me at risingranksdigital.com. Have a great day.